gashes like claw marks in its flanks, but it's also got lockjaw and a warped spine, like it might have died of tetanus. Must be the comrade of the fellow from Pharaoh. Hmm, odd. Looks like he died of old age, not because a necker ripped him apart. Tells me that was no accident. Better investigate. Furrow looks fresh. Boulder must have rolled through here. here. I think I see some tracks. Necker tracks. Clear prints. Necker's foot, hollowed out inside like a boot. Someone lost it while running. The plot thickens. Necker paw and a human foot? Small like a child's, clearly running.
trail ends here. Who would think to hang drawings in a place like this? Looks like the work of a child, or someone who's damned clumsy with a quill. Huh. Two sticks protruding above the shoulder. Think that might be me. Is that a wagon? And here's where that boulder almost crushed me. Necker tracks near the boulder. Now I know where they came from. Just wonder who actually left them. These balls on sticks are Endragas. Guess they were supposed to finish me off. All in all, a pretty elaborate plan. And this must be the meeting place. Hmm. <laughs> Looks like this whole ambush was a group effort. High time I met the pranksters. A necker, torn apart by something huge, then someone cut its legs off. That's it, Roach. Faster. Must be the place. You can come out. I've seen your plan. Besides, I can hear you. One of you's wheezing like a broken bellows. Another's panting frantically like a deer caught in a trap. And the third should really take something for that throat. I'd try time extract. Someone care to explain what's going on here? What's going on is that you're down there, and we're up here. That's a situation I can fix quickly. Richie thingy no gum gum. The bloody Richie thingy swoop man. That's right. We've caught you. You're at our mercy now, and we're none too merciful. Oh, really? Fact is, I could just turn around and... Hold it, hold! Richie thingy gum gum shucky. Well, I wonder why he's not already in the shrimp. You were to kill him. <sighs> what? We never said nothing about killing. Not a thing. We were just supposed to scare him. So witchy thingy us scary thingies. Make him no touch us. I believe you misunderstood. <sighs> He's a murderer, like the rest of them, like the one who killed my Adalia. <sighs> <clears throat> Awful sorry about your wench. We all are. A Doppler. But this Witcher didn't kill her, and we can't very well punish him for another's crime. He has much to answer for, too. <sighs> I heard he killed a Korid in Tucson. But he spared a 
golden dragon. So what? What about Verena? The Bruxa with the fondness for blue roses from Nazaire. He showed her no mercy. <sighs> True, I killed Verena, but you still got a chance, could still leave with your lives. Let's part in peace before someone gets hurt. <sighs> is that a threat? I'm trying to save your lives. Won't touch you as long as you don't attack, but one false move and I'll have to defend myself. Uh, just remembered, I left a cauldron on the fire. Any other cowards? Pull the uncovered! Three against one? We might stand a chance. Get him! Oh. <laughs> 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 